10 things you should never do to your joystick. Do you know that leaving your joystick unclean after knocking or overwashing your joystick is not a good idea? Do you know? The joystick is a very sensitive organ, but people do many weird things to their joystick like pulling, piercing, or over cleaning. Here are some things that you should never do to your joystick. The last one is an absolute nightmare. Be happy with what you have unless it is less than 3 inches when erect. Stop wondering about the size of your joystick as it doesn't really matter how long it is for you to satisfy your partner. Pull your joystick to make it long. <laughs> if you think that pulling your joystick can actually make it long or can increase its length, <laughs> you were wrong because this has not been proven yet and if you still feel like stretching it and pull it enthusiastically you might damage the mercs and tissues joystick enlargement products if pulling your joysticks doesn't leap any results the next go to action is the use of joystick enlargement products however not many people know that these products have hormones minerals vitamins and the companies don't tell you how they work will you still buy them never leave it unclean after knocking make it a habit to clean your joystick after knocking or the fluids released during the act may be a bleeding ground for bacteria instead of wiping it with a tissue clean it with water Avoid using strong body washes to clean your joystick. You don't have to invest in high-end or expensive cleaning products and you can use any mild soap. Avoid using a chemical-based body wash as it might irritate your joystick. Over washing your joystick, it is a good idea to keep your joystick clean, but not by over cleaning or washing it vigorously. The skin down there is very delicate and there is a higher chance of bruising due to friction. These in turn can put you at risk of STDs or even HIV. Wear tight underwear. Tight briefs affect the blood flow to your joystick and also lower the production of cum making you infertile according to reports from the human reproduction journal also excessive sweating in that region increases your risk of infection piercing your joystick body arts like tattoos and piercings can damage your joystick and also increases the risk of stds if the instruments are not sterile knocking can be fun but the use of toys without knowing how to use them can do more harm than good there are reports that a man died after he failed to remove his joystick from knocking toy medications without prescription if you're taking medications for dealing with depression especially sexual line then consult your doctor before taking it the side effects of such drugs include impotence and difficulty while having an choose your drugs wisely and never self medicate put your thing in a bottle insert it in a bottle or toy don't laugh it off an indian municipal hospital had reported numerous cases of people coming to them with a common complaint joystick stuck in a bottle or a toy not a knocking toy so you've heard these are the few things you shouldn't do to your joystick and i hope to see you next time in my next video